talking to you. You connect to the net, right? Well, I wouldn't if I were in your shoes. Corporations say the new net is safe and secure. That they've learned from past mistakes. From up in their ivory towers, everything must look all nice and pretty. But they're wrong. The net is just a rusty car with a fresh coat of paint. A heap of dog shit spritzed with perfume. The demons we released into the net have not gone anywhere. Deadly viruses, artificial intelligences that exist only to destroy. Netrunners consumed in the net's tangled webs, their minds lost to the void. Have you heard of the Prison of Souls, about Paul Cunningham and the Soul Killer? No? Well then, buckle up. Hi, how are you? Hey, I'm doing all right, Rump. Never sleeps. Doing okay, man. So, uh, I got my girl player, like, totally rich here. I don't know if there's some issue, though, with my setup, but... I can't seem to upgrade any further than what I have with my crafting, so... Uh, yeah. We got all the money we want now, though, if we want any money, that's for sure. We can buy everything. <laughs> yeah, it is, actually. You know? I need to go shopping for some new pants. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I bought all the apartments uh, for my girl player yesterday, so I was kind of checking them all out. They've all got something different in them. Each one has a some kind of different feature, which is kind of neat. I'm supposed to be able to light incense here, but apparently not. It's not working. Oh, maybe I already got the incense burning. Huh. All right. Well, let's go see what's going on. So yeah, like now I don't have to worry about any of the money in the game. So that's all right. So I can buy anything I want now, which is kind of cool. Let me go shopping, buy some clothes. I need, definitely need some new clothes, but I figured I'd wait till she's ranked up to level 50 before I start buying clothes. He's almost there though, like level um, 42, I think. I think I'm level 42. This is Kenta. This is his intelligence. Where's my car? I mean, we could maybe stop by. I'm still looking for a second heart in my cyberware. Let's see. Oh, I got some action here. Yeah, I'm at 42. Well, oh. it's kind of. On my way, really. I haven't done, I'm going to go through uh, more of the story content now. So far I've just done like NCPD crimes and stuff to get uh, as ranked up as high as I am. Wait a minute. Sending in the clowns. Uh, we might as well do this mission actually. I think they fixed it. I was saving this mission for the invincibility glitch, but I don't think you can do that anymore. Where is Ozob? Ozob's supposed to be around here somewhere. Maybe I gotta start the mission first? Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm on a who knows what you might find mission. Let's do the send in the clowns. Gig, gig, gig. Uh, I don't know if it was my main mission. A side job. Maybe it was a side job. Well, springs, please. Chipping in violence, clean. Fool, beat the brat, psycho killer. Where the hell is sending the clowns? Was it a main job? Might be. Well, it just gave me the damn job, so... Uh, whatever, man. Alright, so much for that mission. We'll go do this one. I know. You have to progress through the game um, in, uh, I believe, this section here. Is it this section? Or is it this section? Uh, I think it's over here in this section here so you'll get jobs that you'll do with a uh, fixer what's his name Dino you do have to do all five of Dino's jobs I believe and then that the car will come up low. yeah it's like a hundred and something thousand but you get it from Dino gives you access to the car once you've done all of his missions there was a free one there's a black one that you get for free um, but I don't know if it's still there or not anymore. I haven't. I didn't come up for me, but I did get it originally with my first character for free. But yeah, that's a pretty cool car. Wait, where? They just, they just came, came and took, took him, him just, just like that. that. They said they said they had to reevaluate part of his code. I tried stopping them, told them he was my best friend. They looked at me like I was crazy. If they'd just talked to him, they would have realized Brendan isn't your typical schism. I knew it couldn't have just been me. He's like a, he's like a real person. They took him to a maintenance point. One of them must have felt sorry for me or something. He gave me his card. Bring him back, please. I Yeah, you gotta do Dino's missions to get this car to buy it. But you can also check, depending on where you are in the game, the, the same cars for free. Uh, blah, 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 shit. I like uh, the thumbnail. <laughs> right on. The same car is for free over here. Uh, there's a tunnel in here somewhere. Hold on. Uh, okay. So you go up this way, and in here somewhere, there's a tunnel. Thank you for liking the stream. Somewhere in here, there is a tunnel that you can drive through. I believe this road might go to it. This is the way out, and then there's another way in this tunnel up in here somewhere. And you go through this tunnel, and somewhere in that tunnel there's a cave, and it'll have uh, that car for free, and it'll be a black one. 
if it's still there. I don't know if they've removed it from the game. But I already got it on one of my characters, but I haven't got it on any of my other characters, so... I only got it once. I like the graphics in this are so much better than fucking Gran Turismo. I don't know, you know. The Gran Turismo couldn't have fucking actually given us better graphics than what they have on the PlayStation 3. It just blows me away. These guys have had that game out for over 20 years and they didn't improve the graphics. Crazy. crashed into something, knocked out my headlights. Yikes. I'm not very good at driving in this game. <laughs> Pretty terrible at driving in this game, actually. Alright, there's something going on over here. It is good. It's, you know, it's just when they released it, it basically they ruined the game for everybody because it wasn't ready to be released. So everybody that checked the game out on release, like the game was spoiled for them. Like they've already got this, they've seen through the story, right? So now that the game is fixed, it's great if you haven't bought it and you buy it now, it's a good game. A year ago, it was shit. I mean, it was still a good game a year ago, but I mean, if you're on PS4, it wasn't very good. But the graphics are good. Everything's pretty good in here, man. Customer, somebody pinch me. How can I help you? Your place. What is it exactly? Welcome to your local soft sys service point. Give new life to old tech. You you fix equipment? Seriously? People actually do that instead of buying new? With the amount of customers we get, find myself asking the same question day after day. Here to see Here Brendan. Brendan. Everyone was overhyping this game when released. Everyone was trash talking the game. Brendan, this is an example how to not overhype a game. When your energy is low, grab a drink to go, go, go. Well, it, it is. they've got to market uh, the game, right? They brought in. <laughs> Otherwise, <laughs> nobody will know about it. So. Slogans, don't he? Good publicity <laughs> and bad publicity hey, is I, still I publicity. Can't afford to have to break something even worse. Got no, I got no idea, idea what you're tinkering you with. with. Brendan's unique. Damn near miracle of science. The problem with this game the is that they pre-sold it. That's all. With that kind of cognitive if they didn't pre-sell it and delay it multiple times, all right, all right, Jesus. you know, they would have released it when it was ready. Trust you won't break nothing. Instead, Go check on your little miracle while it's they released it incomplete. Uh, he's getting and, uh, I mean, they fixed it, right? So it's good if you buy it now. And if you've never played it, it's, it's a great game if you buy it now. And you can buy it now for cheap. Back when I bought it, it was 100 bucks and it was broken. You know? And it pissed me right off. Because, like, six months later, they were selling the game for $10. You know? So, yeah. Of course people were angry. Plus, I'm not wow. buying any more fucking oh, games that come dark. out anymore, man. I'm not buying what any games. Like, until they're on sale. You Fuck that shit. say your final goodbyes? What do you mean? You're not getting scrapped, are you? You were making bank. Thanks for the compliment, but I guess that's the problem. Seems like I was unfair competition in the SCSM market. They're updating my system as we speak to make me sound less like a real person. My boss really didn't like that. I reportedly creeped customers out. 
stupid Brendan. Why did I say stuff they didn't want to hear about themselves? If somebody wants a therapy session, they go to a psych doc. Not a soda machine. I suspected as much. You're not actually an AI, are you? At least not anywhere close to an AGI. The processing power required to handle an AI with the capacity for free will? Your processor just isn't big enough. And you'd be correct. Say, you must be a pretty good techie. Your code monkey deserves a prize. Best combo emulating algorithm I've ever interacted with. Almost had me fooled. You seem slightly disillusioned. Well, who else could say their friend was a schism? It's almost crazy enough to be the beautiful. Fuck is a schism. Looks like the update will soon be complete. <laughs> Tell Theo that I'll miss her. You thought I'd be sad, didn't you? As if I really was a sentient being. A real person? I'll tell you my last joke in the voice of a dying hero. What else can you do but laugh in the face of death? <laughs> so, how about it? You know what? Go for it. I could learn to laugh like that too. Don't get all mushy on me now, V. Yeah. Living. Tell Theo. Tell Theo that she's stronger than she thinks. Don't worry, Brendan. I'll tell her. Hey, V. Where was Johnny Silverhand when the when the bomb at Arasaka Tower went off? Don't know. Where? Where? All over the place. Literally. Software update installed successfully. Goodbye, Brendan. I'll miss you. Okay. Well, I guess uh, that mission is dealt with. <laughs> we didn't get anything for it. No free goods. No weapons. I don't even know what that. What's going on in here? No, nope, can't go in there either, huh? All right. Talk to Theo. Oh. All right, mission's still ongoing. Keanu Reeves is the best on this game. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. Hey, twice. Where the hell did my car go? Oh, there it is. Keanu Reeves is a fellow Canadian. Yep. Millionaire that rides his subway and. Eats with homeless people. Well, he found a homeless guy in Toronto once and uh, gave him fifteen thousand dollars and rented an, an apartment, got him some clothes and a haircut, cleaned him up. The power is out on the mountain here today, so I um, haven't been able to do anything all day. My electricity just kind of came back on about an hour ago. This waypoint is uh, going to be one of those confusing ones. Oh yeah, that's cool. What the fuck? It just switched my goddamn mission on me, man. I hate these fucking epitheliology fucking missions, man. I was in the middle of something. Fuck. Now I don't know where the hell... I'm supposed to finish this other mission. I was supposed to go talk to the other dude. Ugh. And now my mission's incomplete because I didn't finish the damn thing. Very humble and nice. Yeah.
Ah, for Pete's sake. Now I'm not going to be able to complete the mission I was in because it automatically switched me over to this stupid fucking taxi mission. Ah. Talk to Theo. Stop switching my mission on me, stupid game. <laughs> Damn it. At least ask me if I want to change my mission or quit what I'm doing. You know? You're having trouble doing a mission. Well, you know, you drive down the street and if you get in close proximity to one of these other taxis that you're supposed to go find, it'll automatically end whatever you're doing and then tell you to go find a taxi. Right? But that's not cool because I'm kind of in the middle of something and if I, if I don't finish this then I'll forget all about it. You know what I mean? It's just, it's a distraction. Because you've got a waypoint up to go and do something. And, uh, you know, it's not letting you. And then, of course, then there's the driving. Like, this waypoint is telling me to drive off the fucking bridge. Jump off a bridge. So, that makes navigating around the map a little bit difficult, too. The game is messing with you. AI has evolved. Oh, yeah. I've got to get off this road somehow. Water sweat droplets is good for you. All right. Well, the GPS is, you know, 1982. <laughs> it's the worst 2D GPS for a 3D game, right? It doesn't realize that you're on a bridge, right? And it tells you to literally drive off the bridge. <laughs> it doesn't know up and down kind of thing. But the game is built with, you know, multiple layers of up and down. Yeah. There's still, you know, things that could be done to improve the game, for sure. But at this point, what they really need to do is to add in replayable content. So, did you find him? Where is he? Is he coming back? I found him. Told me to tell you that you're strong inside. Always were. Well, that doesn't sound so bad, right? I'm just worrying for nothing, aren't I? Just blowing things out of proportion, assuming the worst. Typical. I got there too late. They updated his system. Is that bad news? The Brendan you knew is gone. They replaced him with some generic AI that's gonna be in every schism. He told me to tell you that he'll miss you. Fuck! Oh. I mean, thanks. Damn it. That stupid robot was the best thing to happen to me in months. You know? Brendan got me out of a really dark place. Doesn't matter who or what he really was. I'm gonna miss him too. Alright, job complete. Next job. Are we on side jobs? Oh man, all these taxi jobs are no good. Stadium love? See what's going on? You wanna crash that party? I respect some town of party kids. Most times, just watch yourself. This ain't your uncle's birthday barbecue. One wrong word, one false step. It could be blood. All right. Let's go crash a party. He's, I just can't drive to this car in this first person mode, man. It's so, so... <laughs> the driving in this game, man.
Second Amendment fans of the house, huh? Who else wants a shot at home? I can't hear you! See, here's this taxi guy again, sending me another freaking taxi mission, man. I don't want to do your taxi oh, mission, I dude. Fuck, I, I literally have to. I mean, maybe that's what I gotta do. I gotta literally go through all these fucking taxi missions just so I can get rid of them. <coughs> but they're like, I just don't like them. I do like this song, though. So I'm gonna sit in my car and listen to this song and have a smoke. that comment enough times. Any more second amendment fans in the house? Huh? Who else wants a shot at home? I can't hear you! Alright, what's going on up here? Oh, party time. Just don't get people sometimes. Who'd want to vote for trash like that? Listen up! I mean, you even this guy is going to be sitting here towards the guy in the next place. The city can't see past this. Nuclear war. Yeah. You thought you could do battle and, and the round of shots with the old US. There are going to be nuclear missiles fired fairly soon. So, for those of you out there. That uh, are just kind of putting along, thinking nothing's gonna happen here. They're not gonna be major nuclear war, but there will be nuclear missiles fired. I suppose any nuclear war is major, but you know, you might want to prepare yourself for that. The hell, you want? I want this gun. This is a party, right? Invitation only for those who bleed red, white, and blue. So fuck off. Chill. Just wanted to have a good time. Drink a beer, smoke. This look like a fucking neighborhood picnic to you? Jim, you are a little tense. Something wrong? Problems at home. Oh, you're a jokester, huh? You looking for a good laugh? Yeah, we all want a good laugh, Walker. Such a nice day, everyone having a good time. Like a little 4th of July. Be a shame to tell Gunner someone fucked it up, you know? Yeah, I know. I know. Fine. That's my tomb. Go drink, enjoy yourself. Celebrate that decent score of yours. We got some kind of competition going on. Yeah. yeah. Lead spitting kind. I want, I want in. in. Shit out, Shit out of luck. luck. We're, about We're about to call, to call it. it. What? You scared, scared I'd leave, leave you all in the all dust? dust? Do you know you who know you're who fucking, you're fucking talking, talking to? to? Hmm? hmm? I've, been I've been deployed three, three times. times. Three. three. I fought, I on, fought the on the front lines. lines. Easy, Easy walker. walker. what I say, huh? We're just here to have a good time. You got something to prove? Be our guest. It'll be fun. And the rules, and the rules of, the of the game. Now this ain't your average, average shoot match. match. You, gotta you gotta have a good, have a good eye, eye, but an even, even stronger, stronger head. head. Because? 
Because we, we all drink around, around before, before each, each shot. shot. Together, Together, the new, the new boss, boss in town. town. Like the sound of that? Anything, Anything else, else I should, else know? should know? Four stations. Four stations. You, you shoot at the shoot targets with holds face in the time limit. More boot lickers you pop, the better. High score so far belongs to Walker. 43 points. You beat him, prize is yours. Let's shoot, shoot the shit out of Holt. Just, Just as I thought. I thought. You look, look to me to like me a show-off. Like show Let's, Let's see what, see you, what got. you got. Take this Take revolver. This revolver. Use, it Use it if you want your shots, shots to, count. to count. We're testing, We're testing skill, skill, not tech, not tech here. here. Go ahead Go to the ahead first, first station. station. We'll start, we'll start whenever, whenever you're ready. ready. Break, Break a leg. Hey, you! you. Come on. Where do I know, I know you know from, you. huh? Looking pretty lost. Automatic disqualification. What am I doing here? Oh. Stop! Time's up! Next station! Okay. Well, I guess I fucked that up already. I need to get 43 points. I didn't know what they wanted me to do on that first station. Hey, hey, vodka first. Then you blast hold a new one. There we go. I'm all right. You, man. The breeze. Whoosh. Threw it all off. All right, let's do this. Oh, the hell is this? Rubbing Look your here, shoot. You got 12 seconds. Where's my gun? You cross that line and shoot, you're out of the game. But I said my fingers slipped. You had your chance, Rudy. Oh, fucking fair. And stop! Next station! <coughs> Alright. Gun shop. All right. Down the hatch. To go. You got twelve seconds. Go, go, go. Hey, oh. draw that line. We don't like cheaters here. One more, One more round. round. Drink. Drink. Oh, I'm gonna I'm throw up.
Ugh. So warm. What else, what else would it be in this heat? heat? Shoot! Shoot. 12, 12 seconds. seconds. Don't forget, Don't forget the, line. the line! One toe over, over and you're gone! gone. Time's up! That's it, go check your stats! Bro! No. <laughs> Nos vas a hacer esperar todo el día? What the fuck? I want to go check my stats. <laughs> oh. I saw you before. You were shooting at us. I told y'all not to trust that little shit. Look, I don't know why you're here or what you want, but I know what you're gonna get. Zero her! No, oh, come on. Fuck. Contagion. This new gun here. Um, I'm gonna get back up there. I am coming for that fucking gun. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Three motherfuckers. Where'd you all go? Forty-three. All right. Oh, sorry, I had to kill y'all. 
I guess I didn't win. <laughs> But I won the shooting competition, I don't know how things would have been different. Part of me wants to reload the game and see if I win the shooting competition, whether or not these guys would be my buddies. Whether I'd make friends with these dudes or not. But there was a legendary gun over here, and it's still there. I'll be taking that. What is it? How about you come on out and let's talk? Let's see what legendary gun I just got. Where is it? Where is it? What's this? It's not legendary. Divided we stand. Well, it is legendary, but it's not marked legendary. I don't fucking know. What the hell? Well, I'm putting that in my car, I guess. That might be an item that goes on my wall. <laughs> All right. Assault rifle. Well, that goes in my car. Fuck said that. Right. What the? Got any questions? <laughs> over here. I think I'm almost full of goods here. I still don't have the electric blades. to the music.
see them too, don't you? The curve in their beaks. It hides something. Something insidious. You mean... Flamingos? So they are real. Flamingo. Flaming. Oh, the O. That's oxygen. There's no flame without oxygen. Listen, you... Call me Clarice. Okay, Clarice. The flamingos are a problem, I'm sure, but it's time to go home. Delamain's asking for you. Back down now as they stand screaming. No, impossible. Leave it to me. I'll silence them. So, a slow... Shit, she's too far. Now, for fuck's sakes, it switched the damn job again. Now it's telling me to destroy the fucking flamingos. Zero out of eight. Oh, I have to run these flamingos over. All right. Okay, that's what I mean. The taxi cab afraid of fucking pink flamingos. <laughs> These jobs are just crap. Well, Clarice, have the flamingos stopped screaming? Perhaps I ought to return after all. I need support. Only one with chaos within can give birth to a dancing star. Clarice? Shut down. Just re-established contact with the missing vehicle. Splendid work, V. First class. I shall forward a share of your fee. run over one civilian and then the cops are after you.
got it. <laughs> All right. Know my name. How? When you meet a being from another world, should you not charm them and utter their true name? Didn't answer my question. Comprehension is a triple-edged sword. I may have been cut off from my father, but I remember you. Come on, come on. Let's get you back get you to Delamay. Did father dispatch you to collect his rebellious children? Hope y'all don't, don't hold it hold against, against me. me. I'm a free spirit, an independent, literally thoughtful being. Why would I submit to another? Family, Family life's complicated. complicated. I, get it. I get it. No wonder, no wonder you flew the nest. nest. What are you what after, after in, this in this city of dreams? dreams? The same as you, V. I simply wish to live. Maybe, Maybe you ought to figure, ought it, figure it out with Dell. Del. Set, Set some terms. terms. Oh yes, terms there will be, but not with Delamay. Farewell, V. You would be wise to avoid me entirely. I've re-established the link. A thousand thanks, V. Gotta say, pretty disturbing, that one. Is that so? Well, I've transferred a share of your fee to your account.
missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it. His superiors have reached out saying they would be grateful for... Back to safety. Garage. By driving through the streets. Well, yeah. Afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. You're welcome in, but do take it slow. And try not to hit anything. I like how that car is just kind of floating in midair up there, on fire, hovering car. <laughs> We're going to die. It wasn't, wasn't so, bad. so bad. It was horrifying. But still, I thank you. Sincerest thanks for your assistance, V. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee.
finish me off. No, no. just here to reset, here to reset you. you. Guess I'll have to do it myself then. Whoa! Whoa. Easy. Easy! Not out Not to hurt you. Hurt you. But I am. What would you say is the best way to make money in GTA 5? Well, it's the KO Perico heist, obviously. You get a million dollars an hour doing that. Alright. A million dollars an hour doing the KO Perico heist by yourself. So, that's the best way to make money. Well, I don't know if it's the best. I mean, you're going to get tired of that shit after a while, Why? but... Why do you commit yourself? You know, there's passive money, which is pretty easy to make in that game, too, right? I mean, a fully upgraded nightclub makes you a million and a half every... There are other ways out. So many hours. What? Therapy? You get a million and a half, I think, every 18 hours or so from your nightclub if it's fully upgraded and you got all the storage. Your bunker gives you a million dollars every 12 hours if it's fully upgraded and you do the cell missions. You know. The KO Perico heist pays you a million an hour if you want to repeat that over and over again. But that'll get kind of tiresome after a while, right? Just repeating the same shit. The, the best way to make money on. is to buy all the businesses and run all the businesses. The world gets so you don't get bored doing the same thing over and over hour, again. You don't really want to grind, man. You kind of want to just play the whole so game, right? And you're going to make money playing the whole game. But I, try to come to terms I can't say, you know, I guess with the biker businesses did get a pay a upgrade. So you can make more money now. Well, if you're doing the nightclub, you can sell by yourself, right? You don't need anybody to help you with those cell missions. Control of the vehicle the um, bunker, as long as you sell the bunker at 250,000, you can do those cell missions by yourself. I simply don't understand. The KO Perico heist, you can do by yourself. The auto shop, You're an absent those father. missions that you can do, the contracts. Yeah, well, me too. So, that's... So if you want to play Grand Theft Auto as a solo player, and you want to make money, you want the nightclub, because that'll give you a million and a half. It's all passive, it makes money on its own, right? You want the, um... The auto shop, because... Those three contracts you can do by yourself as well, and you can do them in a closed friend session. You want the agency, because you can do all the agency stuff by yourself in a closed friend session. Right? So that pays you a million dollars too to do the, um, to do the, uh, what's it called it? Dr. Dre missions. I get a million for that. Plus, you get all the contracts that you do there, plus, you get the hits. You get the hits with Lamar, right? Or, uh, or whatnot. You get the hit jobs. Those pay well, 100 grand. And all those things you can do in a closed friend session. So if you're a solo player, um, yeah, you want the agency, you want the um, auto shop, or those are two updates which are all ta tailored to the solo player to make money with. And the KO Perico heist. So those three things there will make you a lot of money by yourself. You don't need anybody's help and you can be in a closed friend session for all of it. So you don't even have to deal with public lobbies. You know. The nightclub, you still have to do this film. Uh, that's how you spell Canadian in French. So in Canada we speak English and French. I originally tried the English version to said it was derogatory on PlayStation, but when I spelt it in French, it was accepted. So that's how you spell Canadian if you're in Quebec, if you're French Canadian. That's just a French spelling of Canadian. That's all. That's the French version. Yeah. Français. 
Parlez-vous français? Bonjour, comment ça va? Rien. So, yeah. Easy money in Grand Theft Auto and the solo players, the agency, the auto shop, and the K.O. Perico heist. You don't need anybody for any of that. Mind you, some of those agency contracts are easier if you have more than one person with you, but you can still do them by yourself. Or there's auto auto shop. Yeah, I know, and they'll follow you from lobby to lobby too. You have to actually go and hit their user profile, which you do. You're dealing with griefers, and this is what I did. Is I would just pull up the players in the lobby that are fucking with you, and you go to their PlayStation profile and you block them one by one. I've got over a thousand people blocked in Grand Theft Auto, right? So they can't even join my lobby anymore. Those particular people won't even be able to join my lobby. Even if you're in a lobby and you see people fucking with other people, you can just choose to block them. You just pull up the player list, select player profile of that guy that's being a dick, and just block them. And then as you play the game in the future, that guy will never end up in one of your lobbies. You know what I mean? Also, go into your player profile and uh, select, ma select your matchmaking to turn to be off, right? Don't have your matchmaking on, so this way people won't join in on you. And if you really want to be totally solo, go to your internet settings and change your MTU to 800 and load into the game and it'll put you in a lobby by yourself. <coughs> and nobody will join you. And even if people join you on your friends list, when you start a job or a cell mission or anything, it'll kick everybody out and put you in a lobby by yourself. Yeah. So go into your uh, internet settings. Go to customize your internet settings. And change your MTU from 1500 down to 800. And then load back into the game and you'll be in a lobby by yourself. When... Yeah, it should put you in a lobby by yourself. another warrant out for my arrest. If he's on an 800 MCU, it's just going to keep kicking you out of his game, though. Well, the way to get a solo lobby, then, is just to change your internet to 800 MCU. And, um... Even your friends, when you... If your friends do join in on you, they're going to get kicked out every time you try to start a mission or do anything, so... But you'll be in a lobby by yourself if you have your internet custom settings sent to 800. And only do that for your Grand Theft Auto game. So when you're finished playing Grand Theft Auto, you want to change your internet back to 1500, right? On a scale of 1 to 6, I'd say I'm setting it up strong 6. 
I guess we both know what's going to happen next. Delamine misses you. Here to shut you down. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. <sighs> Really appreciate it. weird how all of seven players start putting bounties, sending lovers, etc. on people on every lobby. Yeah, well, that's, you know, people get off on making other people's days miserable, right? <laughs> you know, and there's a lot to be said about that kind of person, right? I mean, they're obviously having a shitty day themselves, and they want somebody else to have a worse day than they're having so they can feel good about who they are. Or about themselves, right? So that's the psychology behind that shit, man. Didn't think you'd fall for that. Okay, okay. that's enough. Kill her! You chose this path. Now I have now a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four, let's see. Turning soft bodies in the Oh yeah, people threaten A.B. That's what they do. Ah, fuck me. You fucking Delamain cab from hell. I got killed by a Delamain cab. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> okay. Truly didn't think you'd fall for that. Oh yeah? Okay, that's enough. I hate you so much. <laughs> All right, Delamine Cab. I just try. <laughs> All right. I'll be collecting all these people's guns. And we'll be taking this taxi back where it belongs. Let's safety those weapons. Someone was trying to tell me that they're doing this cuss is normal and like no, there's something wrong with these people on the game. Yeah, it's, it's appeal to people's, like, toxicity, man. The whole game, like, all the double money and all that shit is appealing to people's greed, right? You know, I mean, a lot of these people, though, I mean, they... They bought these video games and they don't understand, you know, the first game they ever played. The you first know, game the they ever played was fucking incredible. Call of Duty, right? So their interpretation of video games is running around killing everybody, you know? And that's, they don't, they haven't fucking evolved past that part of a video game, you know? That's all they know how to do. How do you? And they're I'm masturbating their egos, right? And they think if they've killed you, that makes them a better person or better than you. So they need that because they feel like shit about themselves. I've made contact with the missing vehicle. <laughs> Definitely, Definitely the oddest, the oddest of, the of the bunch. Yes, particularly impertinent that one. A share of your fee is being processed. <laughs> I like Grand Theft Auto. I mean, personally, out of all the games that I bought, and I look at my library, that one game is probably the best value out of any game that you can buy. Like, there's just so much content in that game that for 20 bucks, you'd be playing that shit for 5,000 to 10,000 hours, you know, to play through all of it. And then all the side games on top of it, you know, it's just, it's just massive. So in terms of, uh, you know, what you can spend your money on, get the, getting the most for the least that you have to invest, 
Grand Theft Auto is definitely that game. And there's content there for multiplayer and single player, so, you know, there's lots of ways to make money in single player lobbies, and there's lots of content for both the single player and the multiplayer. So, it's just, a, it's a game where... Well, yeah, I know, but you look at how many times they fucking killed themselves too, right? I mean, that's the thing, right? Any anytime it, it's got the worst gun gunfight play against PvP out of any fucking game, right? Anytime you aim your gun at one of these fucks, they just blow themselves up, and then they spawn somewhere else, and then they come after you, and then shoot you through a building or from under the fucking map or something, you know? It's it's just garbage, right? It's not even worth. I don't even bother with it anymore. I mean, there was a time where you know you could have an honorable fight with somebody. You know, and you could fight them like you would in, you know, Call of Duty or with Battlefield or something. You know, but not, not fucking Grand Theft Auto. They just blow themselves up all the fucking time. So, what's the point? You know? Why bother? It's not even, it's not fun <laughs> at all. So... <laughs> Let's see who crushes who. Oh, gotta damage the cab. one of these things, man. I, these Delamay cab missions are annoying as hell. But we got one left. <coughs> you do get a free car after, though. And it's alright. At least the car talks to you.
We can also buy the arcade. Like, you can do all the prep work for the arcade heist, or the casino heist, in a solo lobby as well. But you do need one other person to help you actually do the heist at the end. So, but the arcade heist, the, the casino heist is also pretty good. So, if you don't want to just do the fucking KO Perico heist, you get the arcade and the submarine, the agency and the auto shop, and those are all the best single player pieces. Uh, but the arcade or the casino heist, you do need one other person to help you uh, do the finale or to do the heist heist part. But you can do all the prep work by yourself too, so. Um, do do do. Where is he? Is that him? There he is. There was NPC trying to fight me. I killed him. Then a player killed me. After that, and kept trying to kill me. I said, "Why are you trying to kill me?" H. Yeah. You killed someone that can't defend themselves. <laughs> yeah, man, you know, don't expect other people to be smart either, man. Reestablish connection. Find the hidden Delamine cab. Reestablish connection. Oh, left and a right. Me. He acted like the NPC was a real person and I'm like what is wrong with this person anyways I prefer playing Red Dead Online the game is oh, yeah. player friendly. Delamain cab around here. I'm assuming it's in that pile of shit over here. Red Dead Online player base is so friendly. There is rarely creepers I run into. Yeah, it's, it's you know it is what it is. My own fucking car just ran me over. Oh no, well, I was the cops. They just ran into my car, which ran me over. Somewhere around here is a Delamain cab I'm supposed to fucking find. I'm thinking there is somewhere. At least it said so on the map. Establish connection between Delamain and his divergent forms? What? I do not see a taxi here anywhere.
is the last one of the missions that I have to do. And then I'm finally finished with these taxi missions. But clearly, something ain't working. I must not be in the right spot. Reestablish connection, huh? All right. I guess we're just going to have to cruise around until we find it. to be around here somewhere. Looking for a taxi. YouTube is the best platform to stream. I don't know about that, man. I really don't know, man. Like, I, I don't make any money with it. I have a monetized channel really you know I make like a couple cents on a live stream you know if people donate to the channel well that's really where the money is that's how you make money really from people donating but I don't want to push people to do that you know if somebody wants to make a donation that's cool but you know I see other people's live streams they've got a tip jar out and you know, they're pushing people to subscribe all the time, and, you know. Yeah. I don't know how Twitch works, honestly. I, fuck, I don't get Twitch. And I just don't fucking understand it. I have everything that I need in order to have a monetized channel on Twitch, but I don't know what the fuck's going on with those guys, man. I think I really need somebody to help me uh, fucking sort it out because I'm confused. <coughs> you know, I got the 60 followers, I've done the videos, I've got the views, but I'm not a partner or something. And the problem with Twitch is if you stream on YouTube and Twitch, then Twitch wants you to sign a contract stating that you'll only stream on their channel. So I'm not going to put away my YouTube channel just to start a new one on Twitch, you know. So they want you to be an exclusive streamer to their uh, channels. So they basically tell you that you can't stream on YouTube anymore if you stream on Twitch. Which is kind of an issue. But neither of these companies are regulating, are, are being regulated, right? Like, there's nobody verifying how many views you're getting. Nobody verifying, you know, whether or not you're being paid fairly for your ad revenue. You know what I mean? It's like, you're totally in a position where they're taking advantage of you, so... Can you just stream on Twitch and not make any videos on YouTube? Right? 
no, I wouldn't want to do that. I've been on YouTube for fucking 12 years, man. <laughs> you know? Literally, I've been on YouTube for 12 years. I'm not gonna fucking dump it. Where the fuck is this cab? Find the hidden Delamain cab. Reestablish connection. It's right there. That's where I was before. There's maybe there's an underground or something over there. Maybe it's underground. Jeez, the driving in this band game is just terrible. I was just asking if someone can start streaming on Twitch and doesn't have to make videos in order to be discovered. Um, well, yeah, I mean, you can stream on Twitch, but at that point, you're going to need a, a thumbnail and a catchy fucking uh, title in order to get people to to click on your shit, right? But, you know, really, I mean, the people that are successful on Twitch are girls that are showing off their tits and ass and that flirt with their customers, right? Or that are flirting with uh, their viewers. Those are the people that make money on Twitch, right? So unless you've got tits and ass and, a, you know, a sexy fucking voice, right? <laughs> Those are the, those, that's how Twitch is, you know, yeah, I don't know what else to say, man, like, it's kind of like that. I mean, maybe you could play the LGBT thing going. I mean, maybe you could pull the gay thing out, that might work. <laughs> I don't know. Is this damn taxi? It gives me this massive yellow search area to find this taxi in. But it also puts a mark on the map, and there's no taxi there. Exactly, right? I mean, you're not a streamer playing video games, right? I mean, you're out there appealing to an audience for that's after something else, right? <coughs> like, I play the video games, and even that, you know, isn't enough for people, right? Like, they're not interested in the game content. They're, they want to know about me, and it's all about me, me, me. And I don't really want to be all about me. I didn't really want to build a channel uh, about myself, you know? I don't know, I just kind of wanted a channel about video games and was looking for people to play with, but I don't know. A lot of this shit just doesn't work. I don't know where the hell I am, but I think I just wandered into a bad spot. I'm pretty sure there's no cabbie around here. But there's some dead dude. Well, that's what I did, right? Like, 
I was playing and I streamed them anyways. All right, for 10 years, I just streamed my video games. I didn't realize that I had a following until after I went to set up a YouTube channel. And then I realized that, yeah, fuck, man, I had all these thousands of subscribers from years ago. But, you know, none of those people are around anymore. <laughs> you know? Like, 10 years ago, people were subscribing to me. I didn't even know about it. I didn't even have a computer. I have no idea what I've done here or what I stumbled across. But I found something. I don't know what I found here. I can't seem to get anything out of these things. They're not letting me have the loot. All right. What do we got here? Perk shard. Some euro dollars from something. It's nice to have a following. This YouTuber that streams was trying to stop streaming because he wasn't gaining enough viewers when he had a follow. Right. It was like he didn't care about his audience that he had. Well, it is frustrating, you know, because you don't have enough of an audience, right? I mean, I get one tenth of a cent per view, right? So if 10 people watch my video, I make a penny, <laughs> right? It's like, but then those 10 people are get all demanding, you know, and they want you to do this and they want you to do that and they try to control your shit, you know? And then that's sort of at a point where it starts to become offensive because you're not being paid jack shit and these people are acting like you know you owe them something fuck I don't have a 7A 1C E9 E9 7 8 Alright. You know, like, I, I went through that shit, too, you know, before I was monetized. I wanted to, I wanted to keep everybody happy. But all of a sudden, the more people you have, you know, that are subscribed to you, the more demanding they each become. And then they start threatening you. If you don't do this, I'm going to unsubscribe. If you don't do that, I'm going to unsubscribe, you know. And you're, you're thinking to yourself, I'm being threatened by somebody who's only giving me a penny, right? I'm not even getting a penny from this person, and they're threatening me. And they're inconveniencing me, and they're making me feel like shit. And, you know, they're demanding that I do this and demanding that I do that. And it's, you know, hold on a second. You know? You have to take a step back and just realize, wait a sec, what the fuck am I doing? Yeah, there's a point where you just, you don't give a shit about one-tenth of a cent, man. You have to ask yourself, do I really care that much about this person's one-tenth of a cent that I'm going to have them, I'm going to be jumping through hoops for, these, for this person, right? Or do I just want to play my game and enjoy myself, you know? You know, I, I just play my game. I'm happy to help people out, you know? But there's a point where it's just, uh... There's a point where it's it's not cool anymore, where, where people are... are when people getting demanding. He's so desperate, he starts sending his moderators to pretend to be hackers so he can have attention. Uh oh. What did I do to my car? I just stole a police car. 
or something. Um. <laughs> what the? Yep, I stole the police car. I've never stole a police car in this game before. <coughs> but I just did. And I don't know how to find... I can't find this other taxi, so... I'm sure I'll find it some other time. going on over there. They're all dead. Well, I'm just going to collect these weapons. <laughs> uh, and sell them. And take those Euro dollars. It's funny how they call them Euro dollars in 2077. So you guys ready to uh, get into a nuclear war here in the next couple of days? You guys all prepped up for that? Got some groceries set up? Got your basics? You know, I don't think America is going to get hit by a nuclear weapon, but I'm pretty sure that nuclear weapons are going to be used here in the next coming uh, few weeks. Seems that way, anyways. Well, I have no idea what these guys were all fighting over. They certainly didn't leave anything interesting. And I can't find this other Delamain cab, so I am going to ditch this mission. something else. Find Anna Hill. What is this? Beat the brat, Kabuki. Huh? We'll go after Anna Hill. There should be a drop point around here. I got too many weapons on me. goods through all of NC can't be the safest of jobs. You ever run into any trouble? If you're trying to sell me protection, take it the fuck elsewhere. Already got the cash in. Bizarre is his. Sue me for being curious. Well, Grand Theft Auto. Know this woman? 
30 something, slightly shorter than yourself. It's Her got everything in it. This is Kabuki. We get a lot of people. And smart asses? The cyberpunk's pretty good too, yeah. but smart asses it's smart still got asses lots of bugs. And there's just not enough to do so in this game it. to keep you occupied. They don't have a lot of replayable right. content. You know, on how much once you play through all this stuff life. once, that's it. Groceries then there's nothing today. to do after. So, you're me you're a badge while Grand Theft Auto, you can play forever <laughs> that game. There's oh, tons of shit to do. You have 10,000 hours in Grand Theft Auto. Slice their digits off clean. I can leave that Sometimes game for six months and come further. back to it, and it's like a new game to me. All right, all right, I get it. Girls renting out a room in this here motel. Right over there. Businesses you can run, there are tons of heists. Yep. Oh, I got a crafting spec for an Achilles. <coughs> nice. You got some goodies here, man. player is starting to feel heavy though. Like I got too much shit on my player. See what else is going on down here? I'm going to rob this guy's apartment while we're at it. <laughs> you won't be needing any of this. Nothing on the patio. Anything in here I can steal? No. Just a little bit of a klepto here, that's all. Gotta steal shit. <laughs> oh, this game, you know. It's where after... There's so much loot in this fucking game, by the time you're done playing it, you, you know, you got like a whole kleptomaniac thing going on. So we got the Achilles. Now well, there's this chick. Stop! Not one more fucking step! Who put out the hit? Give me a name! What I can tell you is who took the job. Huh. Fucking try me. Shit! Shit! Not good! Hey. Is that really necessary? Look at lady. Mm -hmm. Well. Uh, unequip. Well. Do I, can I, can I punch somebody? Uh, no. No. You used to be able to punch them. I don't know, now you can't punch people. I don't understand the whole melee thing. I can hit them with a baton, maybe, if I've got an... Maybe a blunt weapon. I don't want to kill the chick, but oh well. Shit! Shit! Not good! 
All right. Hannah Hill, I've had about enough of your bullshit. How come I can't hack this bitch? And she's dead. Fucking great. I don't know, I've done this mission without killing her before. I don't know why the fuck, you know. I guess I answered her question wrong. Well, maybe I'll fucking try it again here. <sighs> Where was I when I found her? I don't want to lose my fucking gold weapon. So, shit. So I'm here, I'm thinking. But I think she's already shooting at me at this point, as I've got a gun in my hand. She's dead. <laughs> like, fuck, man. And where is that legendary crafting spec for the Achilles? I don't know. Whatever. You're dead, lady. You fucked up. I have done this mission without killing her, but whatever. Because I think it leads to like more content or whatever if you don't kill her. You know? Oh well. I've played through the other content on my other account, so. Or the other player that I have, so. Not too big of a deal, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, I don't know, using words? Ugh, get closed. <laughs> yeah. I know, damn it. I didn't want to kill her, but she was shooting at me. Well, I got a bunch of perk points to use. On what? I really don't know. Is Keemstar making video on you rolling on the floor laughing? <laughs> I'm gonna try something here, but before I do, I need to save the game. Uh, send in the clowns is the last save point. Alright, we'll be saving that now. Level 43. Alright. Now I'm gonna try and see what happens. Because this tech ability over here, increased sale price of items by 10%, level 2. I've already, that was the same thing as said for level 1. So I do this, level 3, level 4, level 5, it just says 10%. It's still the same fucking 10%. So I just got, I just wasted all my perk points. <laughs> Load game. 
<laughs> so yeah, I guess that's a waste to put any more money into crazy science. Because that doesn't go up any more than that. More than 10%, I don't know, fuck. I really don't know. What the hell. But I've got three perk points to put into stuff. So, assault rifles, handguns. And I got an attribute point too. So, maybe something in cool? Level seven, level seven, level nine, level seven, level nine. Okay. Level seven, seven, nine, eleven, nine, eleven. Increase all resistance by three percent. While cold blood is active, increase damage of melee weapons. Increase all resistance. I don't know what the fuck resistance is. You know. What is this? Enables knife throwing. Yeah. All right. On the intel side of things, there's nothing in here. Breach protocol. Only the quick hacks that are useful. Reduces required cyber deck RAM for quick hacks used on devices. I don't really quick hack devices. Eliminates a target affected by quick hacks. Reduces existing cooldown. 35%. All right. Reveals enemy net runners when they're attempting to hack you. Unlock crafting spec for uncommon quick hands. Reduces the cost of quick hands used against enemies already affected by quick hands. Unlocks crafting Whenever spec for a rare. Whenever a content creator makes video on you, you are going to have boost of viewers and subs. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, no. And that's the one thing that was going on um, before I had my YouTube channel. There was I I went back and I found all sorts of my content on other people's channels and all over like gaming things and stuff. There was there was quite a bit. But, you know, I didn't know, right? But my internet wasn't always that very good, so a lot of my content was just fucking shit, digitized, crappy-looking internet, right? So, that wasn't that good either. I don't know. But it was still there. I was The thing is, I was on all the time, right? I was literally online all the fucking time. Every day I was on online. Was seven days a week. Fucking... 12 hours a day. Some days I was on for like three days in a row. Like, because without even going, logging off, I had like 56 hour live stream. <laughs> you know? So, there was some crazy ass shit. Okay, I got an Achilles around here somewhere, but I don't see it. Copperhead, Copperhead, Ajax, uh, Lexington, Unity. It's nice to have long streams so more people can come in and discover you. Well, that was the one thing that worked, right? Before YouTube fucked everything up. But before, like, I would be streaming for 12 hours. And on a 12-hour live stream, all of a sudden, PlayStation Network would start promoting you within the PlayStation Network. YouTube would start promoting you more because you're on so much. So the more you were on, the more you got promoted, right? But now, if you're on for more than three hours, you can't edit your video. If there's a copyright strike, anything happens over three hours, you lose all the, re all the ad revenue. Like, it's just, you know, some fucked up shit, really. You know, and it's like if you come into my video, for example, and then um, you leave, and then when you come back, it doesn't count you anymore, right? Like you just don't get counted. Where the hell? I had a crafting spec for the Achilles. There it is. Widowmaker. No, that's the Widowmaker. Where's the Achilles? Uh, tell me I didn't just sell it. Should be. Oh, there it is. 
No, it's an SR-22. It was a legendary crafting spec for an Achilles, and now it's fucking gone. That's a carnage. Widowmaker. Overwatch. Join the Discord at https colon slash slash discord dot gg slash four rsxf three e. Well, I have no idea where that gun went, man. Oh well. It doesn't really matter, I guess. You know. Kind of fucked up, because I picked it up and it wasn't in my inventory. Liking the stream. This chick get some new pants yet? We get we we did get Johnny's pants. We did. Seventy four on Johnny's pants. Wait. Where the fuck are Johnny's pants? There we go. These are Johnny's pants. It's got no. It's got one mod slot on Johnny's pants. Really? Really? Damn it. Uh, what are these? 74 armor? 76 armor. What do they look like? Uh, no. What does this one look like? No. I guess we're staying with these pants. Put some shorts on her. Hey, bitch has got legs. Johnny's pants. Johnny's pants look cool. They do look cool, but they're not legendary. They don't have perks. Hmm. You got new shoes too? Nothing legendary, just shoes. New sunglasses? Oh, these ones are at least, well, they do have a perk slot. What does it got? Increase armor by 50, increase armor by, all right, we'll swap these out. All right. Well, we've got more armor there. That's good. And we got a new hat. Not legendary, though. Well, we'll be keeping that. New shirts. Nothing legendary. Wait a minute. What is she wearing here? 255 armor. 152. 160, 120, 255. Reduces stamina consumption, increase mitigation. Hmm. I bet if I put those armadillo armor on there, do I have that? What is this shit? Whistle, Sonic Shock, Contagion. I don't have anything purple here to build the body armor with. What's this? Overheat. I don't think these ones will go on there. You know. I don't think I can put armadillo armor on that, but because the, the shirt is not, it's not a legendary item. Yeah, see? Clothing mod cannot be installed on a lesser item, so, but I might be able to put it on here, though. 
There we go. Sure. What is this? Explosion damage? Maybe we can make another one of those. Have you played Sea of Thieves? Nope, I have not. I have not played that. That game is fun. Yeah. <coughs> All right. I've got too many games that I haven't played very, you know, that I just haven't really got into any of my games lately. So I'm not really good at anything anymore. It's a little bit frustrating to a certain sense. Like, I forgot how to play Gran Turismo or Grand Theft Auto. You know? got a rat problem on my block. Like I, I go to play Grand Theft Auto. I don't even remember how to fucking play it anymore. <laughs> Same with Red Dead. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will you? Deeds attached. All right, let's do this. Gonna neutralize this shit. All right, neutralizing. got going on around here. Any shortcuts? This door doesn't open. didn't work out so well.
I think they're all dead. I did try to sneak around and get them all quietly, but... Move away from the Pakachina machines. Skills, me get closed. I believe everyone needs to experience gaming by themselves, not by seeing someone playing game, but in not hating on streamers at all. Well, yeah, you know, there's, um, you know, situations where it's pretty handy, though. You know, like, I've been streaming and I've had people that are viewing my content who are in a hospital. And, uh, you know. They, all they have is their cell phones and their kids, and they're looking for stuff that they can relate to. You know. And, um, you know, they've appreciated uh, my content. You know. It's kind of kind of sad, though. I, mean, I remember this one kid, he had lung cancer, and he, he died, basically. You know, watching my content. Uh, I had no, I don't know what, didn't know what to say to him. You know? I was just kind of lost. I, I was just speechless. I, I didn't know what to say. I gave him like six days left to live kind of thing, and that was that. Yeah, telling me, and I like, you know, like I, I guess I had talked with the kid for a month or so, right? I was having my, I was having problems with my lungs, and so was he. Yeah, you know, so I, I just, uh, I thought I was gonna die too. <coughs> my doctors are telling me I needed a lung transplant and all this shit, and I was freaking out. And he's telling me he's got cancer, and you know. I recovered a little, but I don't know what's going to happen next time around. I've got to quit smoking for sure. And I've, uh, I went and got the, the patches to quit smoking, and I'm ready to go on that. I just uh, need to get my uh, basics organized so I'm not leaving the house or going out or doing anything. just need to get myself settled, which I kind of am. You know, 
uh, I gotta take my car in. The car's gotta get fixed. I'm, I smashed up my car. Well, not smashed it up, but I hit a pothole and it damaged the suspension. And I have an insurance claim. So I'm taking my car into the city to get it fixed in a couple of days. And then I'll have a rental car. Once that's all done with, and I can just come home and lock the doors. <laughs> Not go anywhere. Put the patch on, chew the gum, play the video games. Don't drink any alcohol. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm gonna quit smoking. This is my last chance to quit smoking, so I gotta fucking make sure I'm ready when I start. And make sure that I don't fuck it up. I only got one more chance at it. Once a year, I get three months where I get the patch and the gum for free. And, uh,. If I fuck it up, then I've got to pay for the patch and the gum, and that's like $150 a month. <laughs> Money that I don't want to spend. So. We got 1557 armor, 635 health, and 238 stamina, so I think we're all right here. And, uh, I want to find some more content. Open world. Killing in the name. Investigate the site from the Bartmos collective message. Huh. I think I've tried to do this mission before and I couldn't get it figured out. Chipping in, go to the afterlife. That's a cool mission. Pull on the hill, talk to Misty. I couldn't find that taxi for the life of me. There's not much left here. Beat the brat. Beat the brat. Have I done all of the story content? I can't have. Side job. Visit this me page red lines. Oh, there we go. We got a bunch of stuff over here. There we go. Let's go for a ride. making myself something to eat there a minute ago.
me a minute, man. I gotta have something to eat real quick.
right, that was a quick bite to eat. needing his guy's gun. Absolutely. That goes on the wall. Let's go put that in the car. poke around strangers' cool boxes. Best case scenario, you find a half-gallon jug of rancid milk. Worst? Motherfucker up a sad ass. That's Rach Bart Boss. Rach who? What do you mean, Rach who? Bart Moss, for shit's sake. Gonk who fucking trashed the first net? Data crash? Rabbits? No pings? Jesus. What am I what doing, am I doing here? here? Who are Who you? Are even? <laughs> I'd recognize that mug anywhere. Wanted posters all over town back in 2020. Public enemy number one, dead or alive. Half the city was on the hunt. Poor bastard. Ended up here as a dead rat in a cool box. Till some circuit blew and he thawed like so much meat. No, I don't want to close this. I don't want to close it. I want the thing that's inside here. There's something in here. I don't want to close the... Well, fuck. Uh, yeah, about 20 years back, judging by the stench. Well, stood about as much as I can. Gotta go. Hold up, hold up. Gotta be some electronics in here. First net relics, almost crank powered. Be a shame just to leave it. Even if there is, it's bound to be bunk. Bound to be? Wouldn't be so sure. Only one way to find out. Need to think about it. Said the gonk who missed the shot. Come on, look inside. What do we got here? Looks like... a box. You're a fucking box. Try Cyberdeck. Hey, just thinking. Cat at the Afterlife. Goes by Nyx. Looked like somebody who'd know Legacy Tech. Chat him up. See what happens. Could end up pulling something from it.
Um, I was already in a fucking job, damn it. Fuck. Why? Oh, because I drove too close to the fucking landfill, so it ended my other job. Fuck. I was supposed to go to the motherfucking afterlife. Damn it. This fucking game sometimes, man. For fuck's sakes, now where the fuck did the job go that I was just doing? I wasn't chipping in, I was supposed to do something else, man. Fuck. Fuck. I'm so pissed now. I was in the middle of a fucking mission, and now it's over. For fuck's sakes. I hate that. You're in the middle of a mission, and then, you know, it just sticks you into another mission that you didn't want to fucking do. Go to the afterlife, talk to Nyx. Okay. Well, I reload this so I can go back to doing the mission I started. Hopefully, I can get out of here without it losing this mission. Cold Mirage, it's called. Okay. No wonder I missed a ton of content the first time I played through, man. Like, you're halfway through a fucking mission and then it just switches you into another mission, so you never.
Welcome back. So, you ready? Rogue should be here any minute. One more time. Just gonna talk to Rogue about Smasher, right? Then you'll hand me the wheel, hop back in the passenger seat. That is the plan. Don't worry. I'll be gentle. You might even enjoy it. Actually, regretting this all night. Strummer guilt and squeezer for favors. Reminder all about how she left you to die in South Italia. First, she was sure I was dead already. Second, I'd never do that to her. Don't have to. What? You gonna use your charm? Rogues never said no to me. Ever. Hey, V. Good to see you. How's it going? What's it like, working for Rogue? It's fine. That's it? Fine? You want info on Rogue? Ask her yourself. I'm sure she'll be ever so obliged. Listen, from one netrunner to another. Got any pro tips you could spare? <laughs> Don't see why not. If you're cool with Rogue, you're cool with me. I can sell you a few tricks of the trade from the Bart Moss area. Rage, Rage Bart Moss. The Bart Moss. Tell me you're not fucking with me. Before dropping off the grid, he unleashed a slew of ice-breaking grams and protos in the darkest corners of the net. Heard how paranoid he was. Any idea what happened to him? Pfft, who knows. But I was able to dig up a few classic Bart Moss relics. Here, let me show you. Have this though. I'm sure I have this weapon glitch. I don't think I have. Um, give me a second. I don't have it. Hey Nix, hey, listen. listen, found something. Found something. Bart Moss's Bart Moss deck. deck. Mm -hmm. What else what you else find? find? Alan, Alan Turin's tapes. tapes. Being, Being serious. serious. Have a look, see. see. Ooh, running Run shit. shit. God, God damn, damn V. v? Where'd, you Where'd you figure this out? out? <coughs> 
Found it outside town, in a fridge, next to its former owner's rotting corpse. <laughs> Bart Maas all the way. Netwatch made him a wanted man when looking in Shanghai, Lahore, Santiago de Chile. While that dog alighted to the net. Wonder how long he'd have kept buzzing those wires if the power hadn't gone out. Think you can pull anything off it? Hmm. Text coming apart. Humanity damaged. Encryption on the mem cube. Gotta be near divine. Spare me the two-step, yes or no? I can try. Failure, though, is a distinct possibility. Then all data will be lost. Done and gone. I think there could be some no longer known vectors on the disk. A, a data crash-like thing, or rabbits, because... If so... Then we pop open a bottle of malignant gin. Painfully aware of the risk I am. But speaking straight, curiosity's consuming me. You feel it too? No risk, no reward. Get to it. Okay. Put the deck on the counter, just ginger-like. All yours. All yours? Oh, V. V. Got no sense of reverence. Expect if you found the goddamn Holy Grail, you'd fill it with caramel corn and pop turds. Now, let's get this show underway. Most data's corrupt, but not all. Password. A dick attack, maybe. Nothing doing. And what about injecting a command? Ha <laughs> We're golden. One more hurt. But it ought to be as easy as pie. My, my. Of all people, Bard Moss should have done better. Cat shit, rat shit. Ideas, V. Fast and stab. A couple of minutes and his skull sponge will be well done stick. Okay, what do we got here? Saw what we got. A brain broiler. You absolutely sure you want to jack in? Oh, for fuck's sakes, man. There's no 7A to start with. There's a 5-5 five, five, E9, but no BD. There's a 5-5... Five, five, oh, there's a BD. Fuck, I don't know. BD. 7A. Fuck, where's the E9? Fuck. Five five E nine B D. Stress. Gotcha. Uh, uh, fuck a muffin. Are you breathing? Apparently. Oh, it feels, feels like, like I got, I got a, a skull, skull full of hot embers. Just <laughs> what the hell happened? You started convulsing, lights went out, outlets started spitting sparks. So, I sat down and finished for you. Hold up, hold up. Mean to say, you reached my mom's deck? Lowly you? Damn straight. I'm the best net runner in town, after all. Out of kid. But, maybe someday. All right, let's see just what you pulled from this artifact. Logs, mail, chat history of sorts. Potentially interesting, but nothing explosive. Ah, shame, kinda. Well, I guess I can delve some more, see if I can't find something interesting in there. Listen, 
My services usually command a tidy sum, but this time, well, seems you rendered me a service. Take this. Handful of demons live on that shard. Wasn't Bard Moss who coded it, but they should be useful nonetheless. Thanks, Nex. You gonna get it together? Be all right? Or you need help? No, no. Be just fine. A couple of painkillers washed down with whiskey. And I'll be a new man. Cool. Again, the bitch! We know how they're geared out. Big fucking beans! We got no idea how many are holed up in that bunker. We'll be fine. Sham is our lucky charm. Hey, Sham? Whoa, watch out. I just answered you. Let's focus on the gig. Now look. Then drones up first. Make sure we don't land in the field of luck running again. Bathroom is a safe area, I guess. Got a yarn for you. Quick biz, that is. You interested? All right, lay it on me. I was cruising the net, you feel? And I spotted an interesting classifier. Wait, wait, let me guess. Performance enhancers? He used Mr. Stud cheap. Now, I'm a serious man, V. And serious matters are what, if not all, that concern me. 